Next spring, the City of Wildwood and the Missouri Department of Transportation will begin construction on Route 109 between Highway 100 and Manchester Road. The construction will include the widening of the 109 bridge over Highway 100, as well as the addition of two roundabouts, one immediately south of the bridge and one at Main Street. Planning for this upcoming project began just shortly after the completion of this stretch of Route 109 between Lafayette High School and Highway 100. We've been involved in the planning and design for several years now. It's only been 2017 where we were able to get funding through MoDOT for construction of this segment to the south. We have a program where cities and counties can, if they want to accelerate a project or do one that we don't have planned for a while, they can apply for what we call cost share funds. MoDOT and the city of Wildwood will each pay half the cost for the roundabout replacing the traffic signal at the eastbound Highway 100 ramps. By replacing current intersections with these roundabouts, Wildwood hopes to reduce high impact collisions. One of the main reasons roundabouts are utilized is because they're typically safer than signalized intersections, and that's because the crashes that result from a roundabout intersection are less severe. The roundabout will also be replacing the current crosswalk across 109, causing Wildwood to construct a pedestrian tunnel under the road. If there's one disadvantage with roundabouts, it has to do with pedestrian crossings. Traffic studies report that on average just under 17,000 vehicles cross this bridge behind me every day. During construction, this bridge will be opening just one lane each direction. It will be more congested. If, if you can leave a little earlier or a little bit later in the morning rush hour and the same thing in the evening, um, you know, that's one of the best things people can do. After the completion of this project, this one mile stretch of 109 will consist of four roundabouts, two pedestrian tunnels, and one pedestrian bridge. However, MoDOT and Wildwood have not left out other areas to consider improving. I know at Wild Horse Creek and 109, that gets very congested. And actually, MoDOT has been in the process of looking at, you know, what is our best option there. Although possible improvements to sections of 109 to the north are years away, bidding for the current project south of Highway 100 will begin in February, and MoDOT hopes to complete all road work before snowfall in winter of 2019. Reporting for the Lancer Feed, this is Jack Weaver and Delaney Stoles.